on in your hotel. Right below the uh, MRT station uh, at, in, in Taft, and um, yes, it took me took us today about 15 to 20 minutes to to arrive here at Terminal 3 um, of the airport at the Illinois Aquino International Airport. So we were taking Cebu Pacific. Yes, we got to uh, depart from Terminal 3, but uh, I'm taking Philippine Airlines now. So I've got to hurry actually because my flight is at. 10:30 tonight, so I've got to check in at least an hour before my flight, and it's already 8:30. Uh, we left uh, Pasay uh, at about 8:15 in the evening, so it took us 15 minutes to arrive here. So actually, the airport loop bus uh, loads and loads passengers after bay eight. So you see there are bay numbers here. On the columns of the uh, terminal building, so it's uh, on B8. So upon your arrival, um, you can proceed to that area if you want to take the airport loop bus going to Pasay, and from Pasay you can take the MRT or LRT from there. Uh, so you can take the LRT if you want to go to, to Manila area, and uh, MRT if you want to go to Quezon or Makati. So it's very convenient. You just pay 20 pesos. And by the way, thank you for those who checked my uh, blog page about uh, Metro Manila. That's uh, uh, Manila Never Sleeps the Blogspot.com. Actually, uh, the airport loop bus blog that I, I made uh, actually took off so well. It's one of my most famous blogs for Metro Manila blog, blog site. We're now here at the uh, entrance of the terminal building, uh, Terminal 3. And yeah, there's a there's a bus here for PAL ambassadors uh, which can transfer us to Panama too. So we're now here at the uh, arrival area of the Terminal 3, the United Kingdom International Airport here in Metro Manila, Philippines. So it's in Panama. So you see arrival information. You can kind of use the toilet, it's there. And of course, I'm so happy because uh, when this is here, <laughs> so if you want to eat uh, when this, it's just right here. Right at the corner of this uh, portion of the terminal building. And this is gate one, so for departures, island, offices, terminal transfers, elevators, food court, viewing gallery, and for lost and found PM. And you see that way, go up for the departures for Super Pacific and uh, some other airlines. But since we are taking pilot this time, we have a transfer desk right here, terminal three. So we have to transfer to terminal two. So we've got to see this way. Wow. It's actually convenient because Terminal 3 is uh, closer to Pasay, so it's uh, if you're if you're taking the uh, airport the bus. So if you are departing from Terminal 3, you have to go up. You can use the escalator, the escalator or the elevator. So for terminal transfer, you have to go straight right here on the ground floor of this uh, terminal uh, building on Terminal 3 here at Minoy Aquino International Airport. So, we're now close to the transfer desk here. So we're here at the uh, transfer desk. This is for the Pacific and Philippine Airlines. We have the queue here. Let's wait for a turn. Yeah, it's great. After the uh, PAL staff assisted me, so I can just proceed to the waiting area here for the bus that will transfer us to Terminal 2. So, um, I think there are a few guests who are waiting here at the terminal for um, uh, Philippine Airlines to be transferred to the uh, to, to Terminal 2. Yes, and it's good because you don't have to get worried because the staff at the transfer desk will inform the airline that you're coming. So, this is the terminal area here, uh, the waiting area, I mean. 
or Philippine Airlines. But I'm always excited when I fly with them. Um, Park buses arrive every 30 minutes. So we just have to wait patiently. They're the stewardess from Super Pacific. <laughs> so after the attendant for a while, uh, this is the bus that we now to the uh, bus of the Philippine Airlines. Which will transfer us from here and then the EA Terminal 3 to Terminal 2. So by the way, for now, Hello my YouTubers and friends of Amateurs. So we're now on the bus of Philippine Airlines which transfers uh, passengers from terminal to terminal. So for my case now, uh, I arrived at terminal 3 and on my flight will be departing from terminal 2. So I have to transfer to another terminal and that's why I'm on this bus. So I went to the transfer desk at terminal uh, 3 so they can assist me. So this is the Ninoya Aquino International Airport, or Naiya 3, a very wide runway. Very nice song. So check for more updates and please uh, do subscribe to my YouTube channel, channel that's Amon Tours if you have the time. Thank you very much and uh, thank you to my new subscribers. Uh, once again, this is Ray for Trip Nare, Metro Manila. There is an Air Asia plane. So that's the uh, Manila domestic uh, terminal. And we are moving uh, that way to reach uh, Terminal 2 here at uh, EF. Yeah. It's a Cebu Pacific plane, it's quite small. was actually traveling from that side of uh, the airport and um, we went to the other side uh, this is uh, Ninoy Aquino International Airport here in Metro Manila Philippines uh, it's in the city of Pausay so we're now seeing uh, planes of Philippine Airlines. Well, the music now is really nice. We'll be taking one of those planes going to Cebu now. Philippine Airlines. of Philippine Airlines are really beautiful. Flag carrier of the Philippines. This makes me excited every time I fly with Pa, the heart of the Philippine, you know, Philippine Airlines. Having this cool music on a bus uh, while trying to uh, see different things of Philippine Airlines.
The feeling was like you're trying to select which plane you want to buy. <laughs> I know it's very expensive to own a plane. Here at Terminal 2 of Tino Aquino International Airport here in Metro Manila. So that's bay number two. Bay number three. Win radio. This is Terminal 2 here at Nino Aquino International Airport. There's Jollibee there, meter taxi bay number 19. This is uh, Terminal 2 of Naia, where most uh, power flights uh, depart. Some domestic flights that will depart from Terminal 3, but for Cebu and Bohol as of now, they depart from Terminal 2. So we finally arrived here at the Terminal 2 of Ninoyakina International Airport. So that was the uh, bus uh, that transferred us to this uh, terminal. Philippine Airlines domestic for Cebu. So this is the entrance going to uh, the terminal building. So actually there are uh, less people here compared to uh, the other terminal. So this is the entrance for uh, the departure. Uh, so Philippine Airlines uh, you have to proceed to your designated check-in counters for Cebu and Davao, you can proceed to check counters one to anyone. So there's also a uh, set of uh, check-in counters here. To if you want to skip the line, you can also do a self check-in if you know how to do it. I can also go here at the check-in counters. There's no long queue though. So for Cebu, you can proceed in this area. And my troopers and friends of Amman Tours, uh, they have a ticket service counter here for Philippine Airlines. So if you don't have a ticket and you just want to really fly today, you can just get there and you can pay by cash or credit or debit card. So that's what they say. So let's go to check-in counter now. And the great thing here at Terminal 2 is that this is dedicated for Philippine Airlines, considering that this is the flag carrier of our country, the Philippines. So as you see, it feels like it's only me who's checking in right at the moment. But of course, there were other passengers checking earlier than me, or maybe later. But it feels like you are being served by the whole you know, team here. Oh, that's just amazing. It's the whole uh, building. You get to appreciate the design of the airport, although it's not that new. At least you can see it now. Clearly, it is there's not too many. So from the ceiling down to the uh, Cebu and Devo flight to serve here. Turn out to. We're going to see the planes now. Boarding gate. Um, we're finally at the um, boarding lounge for Philippine Airlines here. We only have red ribbon, but it's closed now. It's 10 p.m. already. So it's the last uh, PAL flight for tonight. So there are some passengers are waiting for the flight to depart for Cebu and maybe Davao. So we're boarding at gate 12. It's uh, right there after Red, Rib uh, Red Ribbon and uh, across is boarding gate number 11. So there are, there's a charging station here also and laptop station if you want to uh, make or do last minute work. 
Thank you for uh, working on my test center. Here is quite good in the airport. Um, as in my experience, most airports in the Philippines, uh, internet connection is really good. Connect to go Wi-Fi. The smart Wi-Fi, you just have to buy the ticket for smart. There's a boarding gate number 15, then 16 and 17, right towards the end. And um, there's Cafe brand France here. There's also 1418 Food Enterprise. And the toilet is right there. Uh, there's a massage area right there. But of course, they're already closed now. It's uh, late in the evening. Look at this. Next order, hand up for one. You can watch basketball game while you wait for the boarding announcement. Here. Passengers are um, boarding the aircraft now, and um, we're just waiting for our uh, row to be uh, cold by the flight uh, attendant. So the terminal building is now empty, almost empty. We're finally boarding the aircraft now. So to this. Uh, uh, now proceed to the bus, which is going to take us to the uh, aircraft. Boarding seat is very boring. We're going to the airline. Take tape around your waist and push it to buckle. 
always take the Titan. When outside the aircraft, pull down sharply the twin patient cords at the lower end. If flight rest fails to inflate, blow into mouth tubes. Push pin inwards to release the air. Do not inflate your line test inside the aircraft. The lock will automatically activate when the battery is immersed in water. In case of decompression, oxygen mass will drop from above you. When this happens, take hold and pull firmly the mass towards you. Put mass over your nose and mouth. Pull elastic band for a snug fit and breathe normally. Keep mask on until you are advised to remove it. If a child or other passengers near you need assistance, put your mask on first before assisting them. Emergency exits are marked throughout the cabin. Locate the exits nearest you. These exits may be behind you. In case of power loss or smoke in the cabin, emergency lights and path markings will lead you to these exits during an evacuation. For further information, please study the safety card found in the seat pockets right in front of you. We are about to take off and show your seat belts are securely fastened. Seat buckles